don't take no rocket scientist to figure it out. Only one conclusion is drawn, it's simple when you count. My mom's a modern daughter, and I am her son. That makes me coal miner's daughter's son. Now, Grandpa was a miner in a town called West Frankfurt. It was the roaring 20s, but the pocketbooks were hurting. The miners there were fighting, and then they moved again. Outside a town called Sparta is a place where they moved in. That's where I was born many years later. The Depression. Well, all right, all right, all right. I'm here at the famous Top Notch Burgers in Austin, Texas. Okay, hi. I'm Michael Wilson Barber's little YouTube channel. And I'm underneath the sign of the iconic, famous Top Notch Burgers and Fried Chicken here in Austin, Texas. So, as Matthew McConaughey would say, all right, all right, all right. So, this is it. It's been featured in movies and a lot of publicity here. It's been here since 1971. So, I'm going to go in here and grab a number two cheeseburger and fries. I've never been here before. And I will do a final review uh, in the future. Okay, see you soon. Okay, Top Notch Burgers open 11 a.m. to 9 p.m. every day. I'm going inside. Uh, you can have the curbside experience too if you want to, like in the movie Dazed and Confused. But I'm gonna go inside and have a burger inside Top Notch. Okay, I had the number two cheeseburger with the french fries and the chocolate shake. Everything has been eaten. And again, I'm once, once again, I'm outside the famous Top Notch burger place featured in Dazed and Confused and other films. I'm gonna have to get one of those stick things. Anyway, I would give it a probably a nine and a half on a 10 scale or maybe just give it a 10 out of 10 it is fast food like charbroiled cheeseburgers the fries were good uh, but they really have kicked it up another notch no pun intended uh, than the average fast food place locally owned here since 1971 uh, so I would say top notch. I would recommend a visit to this location if and when you ever could be in Austin, Texas. So as Bob Ross says out there, God bless and goodbye. I did not review the price of my meal and do a caloric review or anything like that. On this day in 2024, Looking at the receipt, that cheeseburger combo was $12.59 with the dollar tax, <clears throat> and I had the shake, so that I think that added some to the combo. But uh, if the total was $13.63 for cheeseburger shake and fry, it was very good. <laughs> In fact, I would say it was all right, all right, all right. God bless and goodbye.